tip, I'm going to show you guys how to paint perfect nail polish every time. So what you're going to need is nail polish, nail polish remover, a cotton pad, a toothpick, and if you want some quick dry drops, but you don't need to use those if you don't want to. Let's get started. Okay, so first thing to do is prep your brush. You want to dip it in and then wipe both sides on the sides of the bottle. You should have a little bit of polish on one side, but it shouldn't be dripping. Hold the brush with the side that has the most polish down. Press it around there, push it down towards the cuticle, and then drag it to the side following the line of your nail. When you drag it to the side like this, pull it upwards. So that creates the first stroke, and you'll have a nice line around here, which is just maybe like half a millimeter away from the cuticle. Now redo your brush. Again, just a little bit of polish on that. Start in the middle again. While the polish is still wet, just to redistribute it so it's even. Perfect! So wait for it to dry and then apply a second coat if it needs it. If you're like me and you're a little bit impatient, you can always use some quick dry drops and all you need to do for these is drop a tiny bit on the polish. Quick dry drops, which is the hardest thing to say ever for some reason, are really good because almost instantly the polish will be touch dry. I mean, I wouldn't go mashing your fingers into it or anything, but it should prevent any awkward accidents. Unfortunately, sometimes things don't go that easily. And this happens. Oops. Okay, so what you can do in this case, if the polish is still wet, just grab your toothpick and gently scrape off the stuff from your skin. And then scrape very lightly around the edge. So shape again. But look, oh no, my skin is stained. Whatever will I do? So grab a cotton pad and your handy toothpick. Open up the cotton pad so you have a little bit of the actual cotton and twist it onto the edge like that. Dip it into your remover and then gently wipe around the edges. Also good if you're extremely clumsy or you just like wiping nail polish on yourself for some reason. Here we go, back to being perfect. So there you go, a perfect set of nails. The biggest things to remember for this are to avoid touching the cuticle with the polish, otherwise you'll have to do a lot more cleanup later and it will look very messy. And try to do fluid strokes while the polish is still wet because if it starts dry that's when things get all streaky and weird. Hope you guys enjoyed this week's quick tip and I'll see you again next week. Bye! If you like this video, then chances are you'll like my others too. Subscribe to my channel, then check out my blog at violetlebeau.com. There's even a super cute puppy. <laughs>